High Overseer Campbell has been neutralized. Now it's time for me to spend a little time here in the Hound Pits pub. At least upgrade my gear with Piero and uh, take a look at the place in case I have missed anything. At least I haven't been here. Mysteries of a Mysteries of Bandicia. There's a whole lot of books that I haven't read uh, aloud in the videos. The important ones I've already, and the notes I've already read in the, while playing, but um, not all the books. There's, most of the books are kind of a background for the, for the world and why things are the way they are, kind of extra information. I um, I still plan to still plan to read them. Read them at some point. But right now I think I will just upgrade my gear. And get on to the next mission. I don't think there has been any additional items popping up here. Apart from maybe... I don't know where Kalista is staying. Or is she staying anywhere? I missed that one before. Hey Piero. Can I be of service to you? I think so. Let's uh, let's see what new gear and upgrades you got. If nothing else, yes, I brought Mask Optics 2, bought from Griff. And uh, also Sokolov's Health Elixir, but I'm not sure if that was here already. So what other upgrades? I think I will get the Mask Optics. Do I really need anything else? Hmm. I have max capacity of the bolts and the sleep bolts. Faster reload. I think that's probably probably a good one even even with the sleep darts. I don't see equipment upgrades for the sleep bolts. So I probably need to find a blueprint for that. Accuracy. I haven't really had problems hitting things. So maybe with... Before the next mission I will take range. And faster reload. Yeah, and the coins, coins go fast. Combat sleep darts. That's probably a good one. I guess I will take the accuracy. It's a cheap one. So there I go. I have upgrade. Upgrade it and um, I have 7 out of 10 spiritual remedy. That's probably plenty because I will find a whole lot more in the next mission. And that's where I will head now. Oh well. I will head and wait a moment. The audio player was up there before. The inspiration is coming faster. My mind works faster at night than it does during the day. I'm being swept away and I can no longer tell if it's genius or madness. When Corvo arrived, he bought some force from the void with him. Or perhaps my there than is I even something to you, isn't there? You went and spanked the high overseer in his own house. 
I hope the tools I designed for you function to your satisfaction. The fact that I am standing here and talking to you affirms that this is true in several ways. Hmm. Yes, I particularly enjoyed using your crossbow, Piero. He is Piero Joplin. Even now, he visualizes the next invention. Astonishing. I wish you could see it too. Yes, I actually do wish that. How you doing, Samuel? Everything okay? I think I will go and uh, listen to the audio recordings of do the... Do you mean to tell me you don't know how to curtsy properly? Please, sir. I was never in service with a noble. That's not an excuse. You need to learn proper decorum. The Hound Pits has seen a few lords and ladies in its day. If they were here, I expect they didn't want to be recognized, sir. Never mind that. Lord Pendleton ought to be shown the respect he deserves. He doesn't require it, but he notices. Yes, sir. Sorry. But even so, have you forgotten we may soon be guarding a future Empress? You will be in the presence of the most important person in the entire known world. And you Welcome don't know back, how to Welcome back, Master curtsy. Corvo. But she's just a child. And she's not even here. No one knows where she is. Well, our masters are just the people to find her, I'll have you know. Please learn your manners before then. I just noticed that uh, that the crossbow actually visually upgraded as well, and it's looking even more badass than it did before. That's that's cool. Yes, I was uh, I was saying before uh, I ran in and uh, interrupted or heard their discussion that uh, there's probably new audio recordings here as well, uh, done by. Uh, Lord Pendleton and perhaps the Admiral as well. He always eats very well, even as his wife and child grow thin. Hmm. Look at this. There is new items here. Pendleton's family crisis. Cousin Anna, Morgan and Custis continue to resist my efforts and are no longer responding to my letters. The servants tell me they've been absent from the manor for some weeks. My brothers have always been arrogant, utterly convinced of their own certainty, and they don't really give two fixes for anyone else in the world unless they want something and can't take it outright. But this disagreement over its upcoming parliamentary vote has reached a crisis point. Up till now, the Lord Regent has been somewhat restrained in his authority, at least where the holdings of the gentry have been concerned. If Morgan and Custis vote in his favor, the law will be changed and we will, be, we will all be at risk, aristocracy or not. I implore you, if you know where they are, to speak with them. Lord Trevor... Pendleton. Cousin Anna. Hmm, so there are new items here uh, spread around the location. Memoir, Chapter 28. Waverly, Waverly, Waverly. The very name sweeps one away. She came into our cold marble hall and brought light and warmth. She changed our lives forever. It was only later I realized she was a traitorous little weasel. Like all the boils. Hmm. My father served in the field under General Alfred Pendleton, where he took the wound that crippled him. I hope I will do no less if called upon. Until then, well, there is plenty of silver to polish. Hmm. Have you considered putting that painting straight? You know? Can I somehow put my weapon away? <laughs> ah! I don't want to be walking around with a knife in my hand, pointing people with my knife. I 
I guess it's too much to uh, check there every now and then. Is there a new lock? Yes. Have lock lock. Entry 2. Well, it seems that we have invested in the right man with Corvo. Not only did he free Martin from the office of the High Overseer, but he went into that viper's nest and sorted out Campbell personally. With Corvo in our company, I suspect there is no one in the world we cannot touch. We are now committed to this path. There is no turning back. And have a look at entry 1. I already read before. Well, it's nice that they are always in the always in the same log, you so you can leave, leave the read the old entry while at it. Corvo's proved his abilities beyond question. It's not anyone who can walk into Holger Square and put down the high overseer. And now we're faced with the question. If the city watch breaks in, I know what Events I'll do. are going to move quickly. I know how now. not to be noticed. The storm's rising. Kind of confused, confused there. Sometimes I wonder if the plague is just going to go on and on and on and kill everyone ever, and it's the end of the world. Think of that. Hmm. All right. Corvo's proved his abilities beyond question. It's not anyone who can walk into Holger Square and put down the High Overseer. And now we're faced with the question, could he be dangerous? Events are going to move quickly now. The storm's rising. Could he be dangerous? Is the Admiral, Admiral thinking whether or not I can be trusted? Oh, come on. Someone has to do something with these paintings. Four requesting rations. No new items. No new items where it doesn't make any sense to have new items. Why do you go there, Lydia? Attention, Dunwall citizens. This is a reminder that walls of light erected in our streets are for your protection. However, they will respond to any touch or approach with lethal force. Furthermore, it is a misdemeanor to throw any object or animal into a wall of light, whether for amusement or with criminal intent. Still a bit, still a bit puzzled. Where is the key for this, this apartment? Will I find it somewhere? Along the line, or is it more of a secret? Oh well, I guess. Uh, I guess I will just go and uh, get some sleep. Okay, so new new items popped up in Lord Pendleton's apartment, but nowhere else. Very well. Nothing, nothing new there either. Have they brought me something to drink? I think that would be a nice touch, you know, if they brought some nice, nice drink for uh, 
for Corvo every night. No? Okay. I'll go to sleep now. Okay, let's see uh, what the next day brings to us. Just making sure that I'm awake and not in the void. I think I am. Learn about Weepers. Talk to Admiral Havelock. Learning about the Weepers is the next task. I wonder what that way that is. I do need to remember that I have quite many runes. I have five. Maybe possession, bend time. Just need to need to remember to upgrade when I need it. Have luck. It is every citizen's duty to report treatment the warehouse. and actions. The state depends on you. It's outside. I know the Golden Cat, not as a patron, mind you. I designed some specialized devices for them. I kept the blueprints, if anyone is curious. Don't. I brought you tea as a courtesy to a colleague. I won't make that mistake in the future. I'm sorry, I only thought... Never mind what I thought. Thank you for the tea. I have to get back to the Admiral. He has news for me. I was saying, I would have really liked if uh, if someone from the staff, maybe uh, say uh, say Lydia Wallis or uh, that uh, Cecilia girl, if uh, if they would have actually come to me, wake me up, and tell me where uh, where Admiral Admiral Havelock and Lord Pendleton are. Now, I only had this objective marker. So, uh, sure, I can follow it, but what if I have it disabled? Uh, not even the journal tells me where they are. So, uh, yeah, it would be nice if the... Because I, I think that that's what would happen in... Uh, if, uh, if, this was, if this was real. Anyway. Hello, Corvo. I expect Martin will be joining us shortly. Hmm. I hate to start your day with such a strange matter, but the servants heard something last night, moving through the storm drains beneath the building. Most likely a weeper, the poor bastard. There's no hope for them once the plague gets that far along. Nothing more than a shuffling corpse full of sickness and insects, if you ask me. I'd appreciate you investigating, just to be sure it's not a nosy guardsman that's getting too close. Here's a key to the hatches. I'd send a servant down there, but they'd die of fear on the spot, I'm afraid. Maybe Piero can concoct some sort of sleep poison for your crossbow if you want to go that route. Investigate a disturbance in the sewers. And you gave me... The old port district sewer key. I can also get to that from the from the chain. Ah, hello, Corvo. That's all you have there to say. There are important things we must discuss, but at the moment it seems we have an unwelcome visitor here at the Hound Pits. Hmm. The admiral would like your help in investigating it. 
prior to sharing what comes next. The question is, do I want to go down there or do I want to go... Do I want to go from the... From the door? Well, maybe I will go here. Okay, I guess I will... Go down here then. So weepers, weepers are people. Who have been infected by the plague. More or less lost there. Lost their senses. And mind. Alright, I can see, see to the top, to the pub. That is... Ah, right. This is the gate. This is where the rune was. Oh, the rune was that away. I visited this gate back then. Oh, and I should probably mention... That uh, the let's play is now completely blind. I don't know what to expect. I had played the prologue before, and I had played parts of the first mission before, but now I have now I have no idea what's. What's going to happen? So this is... Yes, this is the door to the boiler room. I hear some sounds from there. That's probably at the pub, right? Just the sounds. Now I, I think I just saw a vision there. Admiral Havelock said that you sleep darts. Look at that, there's someone vomiting there. Those are the weepers. Look, there's someone. There's a lady there. Is that a lady? Well, I don't know what that is. So what I'm supposed to do here? Learn about weepers. Investigate a disturbance in the sewers. Mm, so I need to take them out with sleep darts? Where did... You go to some sort of a tunnel? Can I? Okay, so that has range. 
Can I shoot this other guy? Reapers in the sewer and report Admiral Havelock. Two runes? Guess I better not touch them. An ancient note. I'm sorry, uh, uh, but I won't be here for the next meeting. Or ever again, for that matter. What happened here was unnatural and makes me s makes me sick to recall. I left the result of our labors here for you to keep, but I expect that the rats will consume it before you return. So that means the rune. Oh, I've been swimming, swimming in the, swimming in the sewers more than my share, for sure. Before the sun rises, they toss any casualties into the river. Men or hound, they all go in. There's nothing there. Okay. So the disturbance was sweepers. I didn't. I didn't really learn anything about the Weepers, I learned that there are... <laughs> there are creatures here in the, in the sewers that vomit, probably from the plague. Oh well, I will, uh, I will return to Admiral Havelock and... Uh, you went down there in the sewers? I thought I heard a Weeper in there earlier. You're probably the bravest man I've ever met. Overseer Martin has arrived. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. Excellent. And this is exactly what I meant. Someone should come to you and tell uh, tell where to go. But that that should have also happened in the morning. Oh well, let's uh, let's go talk to Admiral and that uh, Martin fellow we uh, we rescued. <laughs> 